hope you'll uh, excuse all this. Uh, you know, Christmas is coming and all, so uh, having a lot of stuff we're doing and unboxing and wrapping up for a company uh, party. Well, after uh, everything happened, uh, you, know, I, you know, I was allowed to keep the house and the mansion. So I, uh, I pretty much stayed there, not really knowing a whole lot of what was going on. Um, Luckily, I had enough food for quite some time that, uh, after a while, you know, I was curious as to what was going on, and so I, uh, made my way, uh, uh, to, the, to the city, and, um, from there I noticed, uh, so much had changed. I heard, heard explosions, you know, which I've now since seen some various footage, you know, read on of some of them, like there's a lot of stuff going live and now, like football game and the football field imploding and all that, it's just the mayor dying. It was very, you know, very unfortunate. Um, of course, uh, you know, I wasn't the head of my company anymore. Um, I was uh, voted out by the board, essentially because of how things were going with the company. And uh, but you know, I some of those decisions that were done and made. Um, were done because it seemed like uh, the material that you know that reactor seemed like you know if in the wrong hands could be you know deadly and as it turns out we no that was that hunch was a uh, hunch of mine was correct and um, it did fall in the wrong hands and uh, yeah and I made my way to the city and captured by uh, some of Bane's men and uh, taken uh, to uh, taken somewhere I got a bag over my head and uh, uh, Selena Kyle uh, she helped me and Lucius Fox uh, get out of That, uh, you know, the place where they kept everybody until, like, any kind of sentencing that I heard they had, you know, either you die or you're exiled and had to walk ice from one edge to the, uh, like the river to the other, or, and so on. And So many people died doing that. Um, yeah, I'm very thankful for Selena. And uh, from there, uh, you know, I was able to do whatever I could, you know, whatever, you know, granted, uh, you know, Lucius Fox, uh, you know, still a. Uh, guy at uh, Wayne Enterprises he was able to do a lot of stuff and I was able to help him with whatever I could with whatever knowledge of certain sure things I could you know and, uh, just 
do whatever I could to help, regardless of how small they might be in moments like that. Then I uh, this urge to, you know, you know, leave the city as uh, fast as I could, and I thought, you know, that might be a good idea. But if I did leave, then where would I go? I did have some friends in nearby cities, uh, wet plains or you know, access to plains and such. So, you know, it went from me spending the majority of what happened in my in, in at my manor to then head into the city and seeing what had happened. You know, I didn't come back uh, to the city sooner because it didn't seem like. Until it was proven that the whole thing with my money was fraud, fraudulent, and seeing if there was any way I could ever potentially uh, get back the shares that I owned to then be the head of Wayne Enterprises until any and all that was sorted out. It's like, you know, I, there's not much I could do really. And so I just stayed there and then eventually I'm like, yeah. I just see what's going on, how people, how, how are people, you know, I heard explosions, wanted to go, but, you know, without really, uh, with cars being repossessed, it's quite a walk, and so it's like, you know, I needed to, you know, if I don't, uh, I don't have a lot of neighbors, um, I mean, there are, but, you know, you know it takes a while to get to any of their uh, uh, places uh, and so it's like you know I don't know what really all to do um, and instead of trying to just interject myself into things into trying to help but make things worse you know I try to just sit back and think about what I could do if anything Well, Selena, Kyle, uh, I first met her at, uh, when there was that charity, you know, that charity, that event, uh, Harvey Dent Day. There's a lot of charity stuff we hold there, but I didn't really attend those, just as I didn't to Harvey Dent Day. But anyway, uh, she was like uh, one of the maids hired. To help with the catering and everything for this uh, particular event, and so you know, I met her, and uh, I am aware of her past, but she's uh, she's changed her ways. Um, when I could see she was even changing, she wanted out, and uh, I didn't know if there'd be anything I could do to help her at all. Um, especially later on when I was, uh, you know, really didn't have anything, um, you know, except for however much money I had in my wallet, uh, which wasn't a whole lot, but enough to, at a certain point, be able to get back to home. Um, and so, uh, yeah, her helping me was very uh you know when I came back to the city was uh something I appreciated um, prior to that we had met uh, other times before we danced at a charity uh, so uh I really just i don't know uh, there's something about her that I really uh admired and found intriguing and uh, when advised to be best for me to you know leave you before anything could happen to me um, I asked uh, <clears throat> her to meet me somewhere and uh, 
certain time in the day, which was after the whole bomb exploded out over the bay, and nobody was affected. I believe that uh, the blast radius was six miles, if I recall correctly, and then, you know, that was more than six miles away from the city, so now that's good. Uh, no doubt, though, some ocean life was uh, contaminated, which was, is unfortunate. Um, um, but aside from that, overall, there really wasn't a whole lot of a, a human loss that day. At least compared to what could have happened. You know, how bad could have been way bigger than before uh, if you know the bomb was still in the city you know, it could have been very devastating or it was on a truck so if it went off it could have been in a very highly populated area with people in their houses and homes just trying to do what they can and hope that the, these wouldn't be their last moments but you know if it, w if it was, they wanted to spend time with their uh, loved ones, families. Um, so I, I can only imagine what would have what would have happened if it was still in the city. Well, I went to Italy for a time. Uh, there was a property that my family still had that I was actually able to uh, use. Um, I hadn't been to Italy in years, so I thought, you know, might as well go with Selena there. Yeah, she hadn't been there, and uh, I thought I should. I think it would be good to show her. Uh, you know, another um, another place outside of Gotham. You know, wish we'd always go back to America, but you know, still, you know, you wanna. I don't know. It seemed like we it was sort of decided between us, you know, without a lot of words spoken, that we would see what it would be like to spend time together. You know, get closer, and uh, from there. We uh, developed a relationship that is still very strong, and um, yeah, um, it was quite a shock when I found out that people thought I was dead. Again, you know, uh, I was away for a period of time, but during that period of time, I was you know trying to figure things out with my life, you know. And who killed my parents? I saw a die get killed, and so that really uh, affected me. And I didn't intend to be away for as long as I was, but you know, sometimes you know, you gotta sort things out for yourself, and I did. Um, eventually, though, I um, came back and just as I hid this past time. Um, and I think leaving like a note or anything was uh, necessary. Um, you know, I, I just thought that it would have been, uh, it'd be good to get away uh, about, I guess, you know, leaving the country and saying nothing to anybody else, except for, you know, Selena. Um, I guess people made assumptions, you know, I was wound up with everybody who was a like prisoner and then I was taken away you know to pretty much you know be killed and then you know I wasn't thanks to Selena and um, <clears throat> yeah yeah things slowly uh, got to where I was able to 
regain ownership of Wing Enterprises. Um, I still have the penthouse that I stayed in when Wayne Manor was built back up. And uh, considering the fact that even though it's now the record that I um, am back, you know, and with Wayne Enterprises, I have gotten my, you know, the money I essentially had the uh, previously, you know, and I didn't want uh, Alfred to have to return all the money he had received in the event of my passing while he was still alive, you know, you know, you should keep that and, you know, do what, it, what he's going to do. And, um, I still see him, you know, he's a, like my father, you know, he raised me after my parents died and I'm like, you know, you know, he deserves to, you know, have a good life, uh, you know, I want to be in, involved in his life as much as I can, you know. Um, and, uh, yeah. In a lot of ways, it seems like uh, nothing's changed, really, if that makes sense. And yet, so much has. Um, yeah. Well, I actually got out of the as I call it, got out of it just before I, uh, it went out over the ocean. Uh, people say they, uh, heard or saw an explosion, and, uh, that was actually me shooting a missile at the side of the building. And what I, and after that, I, uh, turned, uh, the autopilot on and got out of the plane. Because, you know, I didn't think it was really time for me to go yet. And so, with the knowledge of the autopilot, for a time it was uh, broken, but I fixed it. And anyway, uh, from there, I just, uh, I, I glided down. After being ejected, and then saw the bat fly out through the smoke, and then I didn't see any more. And then I uh, got to the ground and head headed to a hideout within the city. That way, people would think I died. Um, a reason for faking my death was because. You know, the city at this point was fine. Didn't really need me anymore. And so, I thought, you know, all the corrupt police officers are gone. You know. And, um, more honest cops, but there had been somebody who I looked at who could potentially replace me. Uh, and be Gotham's so-called protector, you know, and, uh, the police weren't able to do their jobs correctly due to corruption, um, though Commissioner Gordon was always somebody who was a good man. Though, no doubt, people are questioning that because of the lie of Harvey Dent being a good person. When, in fact, he uh, tried to kill his own son. And he had to prop up the man who almost killed his son. It was not easy for him or I, but 
or the mayor of the city. We agreed. It was good that criminals who deserve to be put away stay locked up. Though, of course, there will be a debate of whether they're just or the, you know, just justifies the means, but yeah. I guess for the period of time they did. Well, primarily I uh, was uh, recovering from the last battle with pain as well as everything that ensued afterwards. Um, and even before that, you know, I was gone for a while. And that was because I needed to, uh, I needed to really, um, recover as, uh, Bane and I, uh, met beforehand. And so, you know, we had a fight and, uh, I'll just say it, uh, uh, left me in a very uh, difficult state. I was not completely uh, up to returning. Um, even though the police were still after me. And uh, I did debate whether I should return to show myself in the Gotham again after being accused of Harvey Dent's death and taking that on. But seeing Bane and learning a bit about him, I thought I needed to do something. I couldn't just stand by and let some masked guy, who you can't even see his mouth, you can't see the words, you can't see the lies he speaks. You know, you know he uh, was very, he was a threat. And I guess at first I didn't care if I lived or died. And I thought, if I died, it would be for a good cause. And um, I was also in a very dark place, darker than before. But after he uh, let everyone know what happened with Harvey Dent and how he was not the saint everyone thought, I thought, okay. I gotta do something now. I had to pick myself up, regardless of how painful that was, and just do something. I had to train myself again, as I did prior, but, you know, this time with more actual care and more purpose than before. I didn't want this city just to die and get blown up by a madman with people who followed him in a cult-like following. And um, it was uh, an undertaking that I had to go through. I helped Gordon and the, the police get back and get back into everything and uh, make sure I had all the uh, proper equipment to help out, and honestly, I think, in the end, it was worth it. Of course, though, you, uh, you know, I'm not gonna take any more questions, really, but, uh, regarding this person who, uh, helped me out, or, I guess, has been helping since my retirement, as I guess you could say, since I and my sister haven't been seen exactly. Um, not in the sense that you think, you know, the Batman protecting you know, symbol is there. But, you know, somebody else has done the cape and the cowl. Though they have now since decided to be another... Um, Another identity, you know, Nightwing, but for a while they were Batman, but still some could see through that. 
they weren't able to see me. I thought it's good to say, I, Batman, am here. But I'm going to be here in a very, uh, in a way that's in the shadows, not so much out in the open, as much as I used to be. So be aware of any criminals. I'm still there. And honestly, I think Nightwing is doing a very good job. I think he did a good job being Batman. However, I guess not being the originator of Batman, I could guess I could see how that would be very daunting. And so, understandably, and I respectfully understood his decision to move on. 